On Saturday, a Chinese warship intercepted a U.S. missile destroyer and a Canadian frigate in the Taiwan Strait. China's defense chief on Sunday rebuked the United States for its provocative action near its territory a day after a near miss between U.S. warships and the Chinese Navy in the Taiwan Strait. The USS Chung Hoon said it had asked the Chinese ship to stay away from Chung Hoon, but the Chinese responded by saying, move aside, or there will be a collision. Finally, USS Chung Hoon changed course and slowed down to avoid a crash. The Chinese Navy ship moved across the path of the American destroyer, forcing the U.S. ship to slow down to avoid a collision, the U.S. Indo-Pacific Command said in a statement. The incident occurred as the U.S. destroyer and Canadian frigate HMCS Montreal were making a freedom of navigation transit in the strait between Taiwan and mainland China. China's military rebukes the U.S. and Canada for deliberately provoking risk. Asked about the incident during his first international address at a security summit in Singapore, General Li Shangfu, China's defense minister, blamed foreign powers, accusing them of navigation hegemony, and warning them to stay out of China's backyard. Tensions between the U.S. and China escalated after a Chinese warship approached a U.S. Navy destroyer in the South China Sea, narrowly avoiding a collision. We do not seek conflict or confrontation but we will not fear intimidation or coercion, U.S. defense security said. Lloyd Austin warned.